Hello there everyone, this is Neca Knight here, getting ready to play Icarus and uh, well, yesterday or the day before in my last video I said I was going to go and play with the vapor condenser. As you can see here, we've had the vapor condenser set up. Part of the, my issue is, is whenever I stare at this, it gets extremely laggy as hell. And I've set up fortifications. I have no clue how this is going to turn out. I don't know if I'm prepared, underprepared, or what's going to happen. Or you're even how to start this. I assume I just place down the condenser and we're good to go, but maybe not. And I really don't want this to get destroyed. So... I went ahead and got myself the wood platinum hammer with the uh, re repair delays, all that fun stuff. I got myself the compound bow. I also went ahead and got myself some flint arrows, some bone arrows, and some steel arrows. Oh, and I also, something that I kind of found out, which if you, this reduces the wear rate of items by 20%. Combine that with this, which reduces the wear rate of items by 40%. Then you combine... Uh, not that... Or is it this right here? The, rare, the wear rate of crossbows and bows by 30%. And that's 30 plus 40 plus 20. That's what? 30, 40, 70. That's 90% wear rate. And I'm pretty sure there's a... Uh, arrow backpack in the workshop that re reduces uh, bow wear rate too. I'm not 100% sure. I would have to go and check that out. But if it does, theoretically, that all stacked together means you would have bows with infinite durability. And therefore, you could just shoot like mad with anything you have. Anyways... We're going to start this, we're going to figure out how this works, what this works, and I'm really hoping... Whoop. Enzyme Geyser. Access to... Press F to access, hold the toggle active. Okay, so I think I have to press the... Or hold to activate uh, okay we're gonna have to remove that there we go all right let's activate this and see what the hell happens if I can get close enough hold the uh, when I look away from it, we actually get pretty well. I had to turn down the graphics in order to deal with this. We're going to try and rely on the spikes to take down most of everything. But... Okay, so far it's just a bunch of wolves. We'll just try not to repair too much. That's 96. Uh, we might have to repair a lot. If this does... I, I don't know if it gets stronger or worse at this rate. I'm definitely going to just run around repairing all of these because if these break I may as well call it the end and for all we know this might actually be an easy fight oh I gotta worry about the walls too apparently think some of them are breaking in. If they are, then this might turn bad quickly. It's 
So far I think we're doing good, but the question is how long does this end or go? And how many waves are there? Komodo's attacking. I think it's right in a spot that... Okay, well, so far this is a lagging mess because my computer can't handle it, but I think we're doing good. I'm not sure, though. So far we've got plenty of durability on the hammer. Okay, let's check this out. How the hell do we tell this is working, how, or how many stages, or whatever the hell? Oh wow. the next stage just automatically initiate or is that do I have to kill something or am I missing something? Well, so far I think I cleared everything up. I do kind of wish I had this set up better, but... Alright, well, so far... Oh! Alright, well... I'm not sure what the hell's going on or how this works. probably screwed up like I said I haven't done this before I'm still learning I think there might be some enemies around here that I can't find that might be in a spot I can't get to so far I just gotta worry about alpha wolves and stuff Oh, that's going down pretty quick. Okay, let's repair that. That's doing okay. Oh wow, that needs to be repaired big time. I definitely would love if there was uh, stronger spikes that dealt more damage, like a lot more damage. I guess this is a free XP farm if you want to like farm the living snot out of uh, wolves. Once they're all dead, you just go in and just take all their XP or oh, start skinning the living daylights out of them because I mean, look at all these wolves. There's wolves everywhere. Look at that. Dead wolves here, wolves there, wolves there, wolves everywhere. Hi, wolves. Uh, that seems to be okay. question is, how do you tell when next stage starts? So 
far this is just me running around repairing everything so I guess if you don't find it this exciting that's fine but at the same time I mean look at this all this XP okay that seems to be doing good that needs to be repaired a little bit I do wish there was an easier way to tell these spikes durability 5,000, 5,000, this is all doing good, that is an insane number of bodies, I think I found myself a f XP farm, because I once saw, well, I could just sit there and farm all these bodies, okay, How do I tell the next stage? What the hell is supposed to happen? Because I don't see any more creatures coming in to attack. Am I supposed to go out there and hunt them? Because I kind of don't feel like that is a good idea. Especially if bigger, badder creatures come in. getting anything so I think I'm doing something wrong it would be nice if there was a little thingy that told you how many mon creatures are left to kill or what percentage you're at or you know tell you some kind of progress because as of right now I have no clue what the hell's going on where to go what to do I don't know if it's because there's something alive down here that I can't get to, or what. And I'm not getting anything out of the condenser. And I'm not gonna tear this down just so that I can get in and out. Although I might just build a pathway up here. Oh. I hear the music, something's... I think something finally made it here. Or did until it died. Okay, where the hell are all the wolves? Or the mission, or the... So far this is annoying as hell. Five thousand. Put one straight up, and then we'll put one like this. Uh, actually, can we put one right here and be good? No, that's gonna hurt. I'm gonna have to see if I can find whatever the hell I'm missing out here. The issue I'm having is trying to connect. We're gonna have to build this like that, like that. The stupid sprinkler thingy right there. It's way, way too much particles. Fine. I hate. I 
need to be able to get up and down this. One thing I really wish they would fix is their building. said it's laggy as hell I'm staring into this what the hell am I missing I guess we're gonna jump down and we're gonna need to build ourselves a way up percent safe but I can get up perfect okay now let's go figure out where the hell we need to go and what the hell we need to kill ow because I'm pretty sure there's some things stuck around here that are causing problems don't know how far away they spawn or where they spawn. Or is it because I need to carve up the carcasses? Is that the issue? Because if that is, then that might explain a lot. If that's not, then I'm not sure what the hell. Oh. There's my, oh. The Okay. Stupid lag. I don't know what the hell happened or why they suddenly came, but it's now now they're going nuts. I don't know where they came from, but at least I know. Holy mother flip. Okay, I think this side's the most important side to be focusing on right now. Same time, sweet. Oh, wow. Holy flip, how the there's so many dead bodies they're climbing up each other. Okay, that's cheating. That is big time cheating. That is cheating. And with lag, this may be the end of me. I really 
wish there wasn't so much lag. with these Ooh, nice Christian shot come on kill this is one hell of a fight Lag is going to be what kills me. Oh. And I can't make a bandage. Sweet. I think I'm going to have to call it here. Or not call it here, but stop this... Bears. I could have always stayed down here, but I didn't. I wanted to show you guys some fun. I didn't want to like. is not helping with lag. Holy mother flip. They need to optimize this a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Because I'm laggy as hell because of this and I've got most of my graphics set to like absolute minimum. Oh, it's a Komodo. I think. No, there's a bear. Alright, I think I'm gonna kill most of this and then I'm probably gonna try and do this off camera next. Mostly because I'm gonna be literally staying at the bottom down here, running in circles, repairing everything. I'm pretty confident that I won't have to deal with things jaguars climbing up each other to get to me. Oh, there's a gator. I don't know what the hell it's eating, but it's... Dealing damage to something. What the hell are you attacking, gator? Okay, well... Are the bears dead? Are there any? Is there anything else around? Okay, well, this was not the most successful run, but at least you got to see how laggy it is, and you got to see a jaguar up at the end come up and get to me. What? When did they introduce? When did? Hold on a sec, can you tame that little guy? Um... If you could, well, I don't know if you can, but I did not know there was bear cubs. That's awesome. But hey, look at this. XP. We're gonna consume this. Consume that. 
we're gonna try and heal before I get wound infected with the wound and stuff. Although it's probably gonna be too late. And we'll probably, and I'll call it here. I know this wasn't successful, but at least you got to see the basics of this. So hopefully you guys enjoyed, you come back for more, and maybe next time I'll be able to do better. For now, if you wanna see more of this series, just check out the end screen credits that are going to be coming up pretty soon. And if you want to be added onto the end screen credits like these people, make sure to be the publicly subscribed. And after about two or so weeks, I'll add you on. If you leave before I reach a thousand now, I'll remove you off because it's pe for people who gave me a chance. For now, I'm going to clean up this mess and see what the hell I can do and maybe figure out what I need to do. So for now, let's just get everything cleaned up and hopefully you guys enjoy. So let's see. And also, bye bye